Hi guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Emma and here we talk about homeschool, motherhood and lifestyle. I have a nine year old boy. I want to give you a review on our Easy Peasy Math workbook for first grade. But before, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I suggest you to subscribe, hit that bell button so you don't miss any of the information that I will bring here and comment. Comments are free. I'll see you after the intro. Today I want to bring you a review on our Easy PC Math. This is uh, the workbook for first grade. My son is a third grader, but we were using the workbook for first grade as a review. It has 180 daily activities for first grade, and this covers number concepts, patterns, addition, measurements, geometry, fractions, money graphs, subtraction, and time. Let me just show you inside, and if you notice, the book is pretty, <laughs> it's been through a lot. <laughs> and, uh, but he finished already with the book, and I would like to show you. So first of all, it gives you an introduction here about this workbook. Then in here, it has the how to use this workbook, and it gives you some uh, instructions here. It, it gives you some information, uh, how to supplement daily lessons to serve as an alternative to online activities, to provide coloring activities. And before I continue, this is a program that you can find free on a website and their uh, address is for all-in-one homeschool, easy PC. So this program is completely free, but I decided to purchase the book because my, work, my son works better when he has an actual book and if you hear it sound is my dog going around uh, but he likes to work better with the workbook and that's why I decide to purchase the book The books are very inexpensive and it is a, a good program it has a completion chart sorry and they will mark in here every time they finish one of the lessons okay In here we have math fact checklist. So every time they learn those facts, they will mark in here. And this is a pretty easy book. What I like about the book is that it goes and reviews the previous lesson. So it, uh, it goes pretty easy for my kid. They can color the pictures or they can leave a blank. He's not that much into coloring. so. Most of the pictures you're going to see that he didn't color, but he did the activities. And it works very well for what we were using it, which it was as a review. The only thing that I can say that he didn't like, which is a con, is the fact that he has to color. My son, my son doesn't like to color much. Uh, and he disliked it, the fact that he didn't have color. But it was good to use just because we were using the the computer as well so the programs that they have the activities that they have in the computer were in color so they were kind of like help with the fact that the book didn't have color so let's continue it goes back and forth with the lessons it reviews the lessons and if this Workbook works by day, so you will look at the day in here. This is day 10, and then you will go to the website and will look at that day. And whatever it says on the website, usually has a game or an activity that they have to do that complements what they are learning here. And it gives them more of a review of the lesson that they are doing at the moment. Okay. It reviews the numbers. The number words, just I think it sticks in here, sorry. So we have adding, adding a number line, which is really good for the kids. In here we have an activity where they reduce the counting by tens. Something else that I like about this program as well is that it has daily practice for the week 
and this is how it looks so they will do one of these lines of this daily practice uh, sheet for day 46 and if you notice in here it says day 46 as well so what they do is they do one of the rows for the practice for the week and then they will finish this page okay the chain patterns and it goes like that for the rest of the book every time it passed a week they will have a daily practice sheet where they complete these rows with this side of the work and once they complete that they will continue with the working sheets what i like about this program is that it goes as a spiral and if you know just go back and forth and review what what is being shown on the previous lesson measuring length measuring high units of measure addition practice daily practice for the week if you notice it goes back again to what they learned at the beginning so it's really good if your kid has uh, problems with math they have difficulties um, learning their math facts this is a really good program just because it goes review so it goes as a spiral and it reviews over again what they have learned in the previous lesson which is actually really good and that is one of the reasons why i chose this program to do a review with my kid okay and it will go like that for the rest of the book and it works it worked very well for what we were doing so the pros will be that it worked very good as a review it was good the fact that is uh, as a spiral it goes back and forth and review the previous lessons as well I like the fact that he was able to use the computer to review what he was doing with the book it comes with the teacher guide if you want me to be honest it's not necessary i purchased the t-shirt guide just because i speak two languages and sometimes for me to be able to explain something in english i thought that it was going to be a little bit complicated but actually i think i was very good with that so it's i don't think it's that necessary the teacher guide but you can purchase that if you would like just remember that you have that program available free on their website which is all in one homeschool easy PC, and you can uh, use it and it will be completely free unless you want to purchase the books and the, you can order them on Amazon and I will leave that link in the description box for your uh, convenience I will have it in the description box okay and this is how it looks the cons will be that it doesn't have any color and if your kid is is that type of kid that is very visual it doesn't have uh, colors in the book on the pages and uh, that might be a problem but remember that if they do the activities on the website that will help as well if you're on the go uh, that will be another con it might be a little bit of a trouble I am usually in doing car schooling so we are not able to use the uh, website that often so we rely more on the book and as I said he is very visual and he likes to see colors in, in the book and this was uh, one that didn't have doesn't have any type of color he has to color he is not that much into coloring and uh, well that will be a gun besides that I don't see any problem with the program I think it's a good program I like that it, as I said that it goes as a spiral it, it reviews everything that you that the key has done in the previous lesson and I like as well that it has the days on the top so you can correlate with what they have uh, on the computer as uh, activities and I like the fact that I have the activities so it works very well for us son is a third grader and uh, we use it just as a review and to make sure that he was uh, knowing 
uh, these uh, ordering numbers and fraction practice and just doing the review that I thought was needed. Okay, so I just wanted to give this review, guys, to help you a little bit. If you're interested, it's a free program. If you are short on your budget and you want to have your kid with this program, I think it will work very well. I still will use it even as a supplement. I still will use it just because it, I, I think it is a good program. It's just I use first grade. My son used to be at a public school and he used to have an IEP and on the IEP it stated that he was needed some work with the uh, first grade math and it ended up being that he was just fine <laughs> and uh, I think I would have got the third grader uh, math book and it would be just awesome and it's a very inexpensive program so I hope this is helpful if it is please don't forget to hit like comment and subscribe to my channel I will see you then bye bye